Hi and welcome to a new video. You accidentally deleted a WhatsApp chat or maybe individual messages in a chat that you need back urgently. In this video, I'll show you how you can restore your data including pictures, video and audio files from your iPhone. Let's go. If you recently deleted your chats, then there's a good chance you can restore them with your iCloud backup. Usually, the iCloud backup is preset on iPhones and you can just reset WhatsApp to the status of your backup. You can find out if you have a backup by checking the WhatsApp settings under Chats and then Chat Backup. Here you can see when the last backup was created. Most of the time, this is done at night on the previous day when your iPhone is charging. If you have deleted the chats after the last backup, just as I did a few seconds ago, you can restore the data. But do not accidentally press Backup Now, otherwise the old backup will be overwritten and you will no longer be able to restore the chats via iCloud. If you have a suitable backup, delete WhatsApp. But consider that your entire WhatsApp will be reset to the status of your backup. So if you have exchanged important information after the backup, save it beforehand. Now, reinstall WhatsApp from the App Store and open it. Set it up again with your phone number. Afterwards, you will see the iCloud backup and you can restore the chat history. Enter your name again which will be displayed to your contacts and confirm it with Done. Media such as photos and videos are restored later, this can actually take quite a while. But at some point you should have your messages back. Another option is to restore from an iTunes backup on your computer. Of course, in order to do that, it is necessary that you created a backup on your computer in the past. If you have a backup, connect your iPhone to the computer. Ensure that it is charging. And if a pop-up appears on the display asking whether you want to trust the computer, click on Allow. In case you cannot connect to the computer, it is probably due to your charging cable. It is best to use original chargers or ones that are MFI certified. If you are using Windows or a Mac with an operating system older than Catalina, then open iTunes on your computer. If you have a Mac with Catalina or higher like me, Open the Finder and click on your iPhone. Then go to Restore Backup. The problem is that on the one hand a backup is needed and on the other hand your entire iPhone is reset to the state of the backup, including the photos, apps and so on. If you only want to view the WhatsApp data from the iTunes backup or the first two methods did not work at all because you didn't make any backups, there is only one method left. You can restore the chats with a specific program on your computer. The program is called Tenorshare Alt Data. You can find the link down below in the video description. The program is available for Mac and Windows and it is able to search the memory of your iPhone for deleted chats that are not visible. However, the full version is not for free and quite expensive. But you can test the program for free and it shows you the first letters of the messages displayed in the free version. This way, you can at least figure out if your messages are still able to recover. Install the program and open it. Just like with iTunes, you have to connect your iPhone to the computer and make sure that it is charging. You have several options in this program. If you don't have a backup, click Recover data from iOS device. Choose WhatsApp and click on Scan. The scanning process of the iPhone can easily take up to half an hour. When everything is finished loading, you will get an overview of the chats. As already said, only the first few letters are visible in the free version. Otherwise, you have to buy the Pro version and enter the email including the activation code. Then, you can recover the chats to your computer. Now, you'll have an HTML file that can be opened in any browser. If you are looking for specific chats and you use a Mac, press Command plus F. In Windows, hold down the Control key plus F 
and enter the text or the date that you are looking for. You also have a media folder in which all images are saved. Unfortunately, the messages cannot be returned to the iPhone. If you have an iTunes backup and didn't feel like resetting your entire phone, click on Recover Data from iOS Device. Select the backup. Press Next. Then you can take a look specifically at the WhatsApp messages or the WhatsApp attachments and recover them on the computer. Unfortunately, it's also possible that the chats cannot be restored at all. The only thing left you can do is to switch on backups for the future. In order to do that, open WhatsApp, go to Settings, then to Chats, then Chat Backup. And now you can set the auto backups to monthly. Your iPhone will then save a backup on iCloud once a month, which you can restore again with the first method. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.